But how much do you think this one is, the barbecue pork? Two dollars. Hold on a second. Two, mm, two fifty to three fifty. It's four dollars. <gasps> and the deluxe bola bola was five dollars. Damn. Yeah. Right. Somehow our kitchen has turned into a play zone. I don't know what I feel about, you know what? No, it needs to go here, this side, cause when I'm cooking and I'm coming here, I don't want to trip on the toys. She's giving me my ice cream order. I ordered mango, is that mango flavor? Okay. Okay. Good morning. We all woke up with a sore throat, or not all of us. Oh, you did too, boo? We definitely caught something. Wow, she took this vending machine to the next level. Made by Mama Sal. Handmade soap. Wait, let her smell it, baby. Mm. <laughs> she it makes smells the like best candy, soap. but it's not candy. Not candy, it smells like, like roses. Bye, and she's going to test it out. Okay. Here, throw this in the garbage. It's not candy, okay? Don't eat it. Mmm, thank you, Mama Sal. She also made these. I think these are bath bombs. Oh no, these are also soaps. So she put a label that says soap, not food. I swear, I feel like in our lifetime we've had at least 10 printers. But the last one I got was from Costco and usually they're legit and mine stopped working. It's now printing in like a pink ink. Is it supposed to be the ink that doesn't dry out? We're trying to print stuff on this printer, which we just got. I think Matt gave it to us, but he only used it a handful of times. Honey. And look, it's not even printing anything. He literally just said, he said, whoever invents the printer that works and actually prints, and that would do rich. well. <laughs> I said the marketing for it should just be the printer that, that prints. prints every time. And you're a billionaire. In fact, just yeah, me you'd up. make money. <laughs> well, that printer works. What'd you say, Austin? You did a paper about printers. I literally was just reading someone's article about why printers all suck, and it's because they make the business model before they make the printer. <laughs> they're not making a good printer. They're making a good business like model. Yeah, there you go. If Apple made a good printer, everybody would buy that. Apple. Sorry, honey, it's not working. <laughs> it's not. So if anybody has a recommendation of a great printer that actually prints, please let me know. Are you a parent that eats whatever is left over from your kids all the time? Honey? Yeah, that's us. That's us. All right, guys, I have to put a disclaimer <laughs> because I know some people are very bothered by other people eating and then talking while eating. So for this, this one's for y'all. If you don't wanna watch Benji talking, eating with his big bites, then you may skip forward. But this is just us at home with a little chit chat. <laughs> okay, you've been warned. Judy made the scrambled eggs and avocado toast and it was just left in the toaster oven. It, it like retained the heat That's for a lot, yeah, for like six hours. So it's kind of scary, but I'm so hungry because I haven't eaten yet. Try this though. It's Why? so good. Is it, is it cotton candy? No. Isn't this so good? Very good. Kai Dong chili oil from Tippy Cooks. I'll put that on there. You never know what you're going to get. I, I come home and whatever is in the toaster oven, whatever is just on the counter, that's what I eat. Mm-hmm. It's so good. Mm. Yeah, the kids really don't like eggs. Scrambled eggs in the morning. Lately, I've noticed they prefer hard boiled eggs. They'll eat it if it's hard boiled, but when it's scrambled, they're like, nah. Hard boiled or fried eggs? Yeah, I guess so. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna go on the bike. Get it. I got tomatoes. I was gonna go to the grocery store. Okay, don't get tomatoes. Should I go to Costco? Because we need milk? Yes. Yes, you should. I am. Go to Costco. Someone commented, Benji excited about going to Costco? I, I would have never thought. That's so funny. I don't remember last time I went because you go all the time. No. I mean, I'm mad at it. Right now, during this season, where we're so busy, we've just kind of splitting our efforts. 
Yeah, it's Costco. <laughs> We've got our green juice, apple, lime, kale, celery. It's actually quite sweet, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of water. Oh my gosh, these two cutie boos. The fact that they get out of the room together is the cutest thing. Good girl, turn off the sound machine. Oh, the door was already open, but Bella waited for Leah. How much you want to make your bed? They're going to ask about Hello. Hi, y'all. Hi, baby. This is no more green juice. Yes, yeah. green juice, girl. Please listen to no more. Here. Hi, Boogie. Hey. Did they not have green juice earlier? I thought you already had green juice. Oh, you want more? Hi, Boogie. How was your sleep? Green juice. Okay. Tostitos. Mommy, guess what? What? Boogie slushies. Slushies? Slippies. Slurpees, you mean? We went to 7-Eleven in Canada because it was just right there across the street from where we were already at and I really wanted gum. I was talking about how I've done 7-Eleven videos in other countries but not here. So maybe I will go. But you have to go with me to the grocery store afterwards. But you only get a small Slurpee, not a big one, okay? We never go. I don't like Slurpees. These are good. Honey, where are these from? Um, my teacher. Where are these from? Daddy, I want it. Oh, wow, really? Walmart, you're on, you're on top of it. Mmm, you what? Daddy. What, the girls, they had their pizza rolls. Daddy. Mommy and Daddy, we've got our shell pal. This is not just any shell pal, it's Newtown Bakery. Oh, that's funny. Honey, did you say this is the best shell pal in the whole world? Yeah, I think so. Want a bite? No. Okay. Out of 10? Show pals, how many of them would be the barbecue pork versus the deluxe chicken pork? What do you mean? If you were to eat 10 show pals oh, in like two, a year. Uh, eight to two. Eight to two, yeah. Yeah. The pork chicken egg one is called the deluxe. I just realized that when I went there. I thought that was bola bola. Yeah, it's called bola bola. Okay. But how much do you think this one is, the barbecue pork? Two dollars. Hold on a second. Two. Mm. $2.50 to $3.50? It's $4. Ooh. And the deluxe bola bola was $5. Damn! Yeah, right? But you think it's because of the egg? Why is it so much more? Yeah. Because it's more stuff. And this is our somewhat peaceful dinner. I saw that Benji got this while we were in Vancouver. And I'm excited to try it out. Long B, long tea. I've never heard of that. Is that a popular brand? I personally love green tea. But oolong tea is good too. Like whenever we go to the Chinese restaurants, we just don't have it as often. I wonder if this one has lots of caffeine. Yes? Get off the table, Boogie. Come on. It's from the Yunnan province of China where the puer tea, oh, it's a type of puer tea. Bet you like that stuff. Okay, mommy, I What's the benefits of oolong tea? It's like a fermented tea. I'm surprised it actually doesn't smell that strong at all. And the other puer tea we've tried, um, last time we were in China had a very pungent smell. Mmm, it's good. It's good. <sighs> Watch me like shit my pants in an hour. Seven Eleven in America. <laughs> that is kind of funny that I went to all those Seven Elevens around the world. This is the first time maybe in like almost two years. Yeah, these machines are not as exciting as the ones we saw in Vancouver, but hey, we'll take it. What? What? 
Oh yeah. That's not what we're here for. This is Wild Cherry Peach Perfect. That sounds good. Vitamin water. Oh, zero sugar. You want Peach Perfect? Yeah, this is what you're gonna get. Hibiscus lemonade, that's interesting. Mountain Dew, Pina Colada, classic. Blue raspberry, I mean, this that's the most old school that you can get. And then Coca-Cola, my favorite. So they used to have actual Slurpee cups. For whatever reason, they only have these ones. The big gulp cups. I don't know where they're at. Yeah, see, it's empty. What? What do you see? What do you see? Oh, you like that little sink? What's up with Why is there a small sink there? It's kind of big. I'm a hug out. Yeah, but you can't throw up. Just wet off. Get my peach. All right, you'll get peach, okay? Oh, yeah, so there's a little trick here. I'll show you. You have to let some of it pour out because it's melted and you don't want that at the bottom of your cup. So giving some away. There you go. And then you fill it up, okay? Oh yeah. And then when you get near the top, like this. Yeah, I'm a the there you go. That's the trick right there. A little scooper. Tell me if it's good. Oh yeah. You and I have to share this because it's way too much for no. just you. Do you want to share or do you want nothing? I'm like, oh, I like these. Do you want to share or do you want nothing? I like share. My God, that's so good. It's been a long time. Okay. <laughs> You're so sweet out there. watch Dune with English hey. subtitles even though the acting is great. We've got two library teachers. Good job. I'm listening. Go ahead. Yeah. Wally. Wally. That's right. Yo, my pink's yellow too. I am living in S. I'm much taller than you. I'm big, bud. No, you got tricked into Timu? Well, earlier today I was telling my friend Austin I need a new backpack, <laughs> fanny pack combo so that everything <laughs> goes together. But like, I need something that I can put my laptop in, mm -hmm. all my stuff for the gym, but yeah. also just my camera stuff because so I've been So like a backpack, a basically. Yeah, and then you want to see the backpack uh, that showed up on yeah. my, um, on my feet. Yeah. Okay, first off, the color, and then <laughs> it looks like you're about to go work in Silicon Valley. He goes, have you heard of Timu? I'm like, oh my gosh, it's like a wish.com. But I've heard some people say there's, there's like lots of misses, but there could be a handful of hits. It's like a glorified dollar store. I guess it's zero dollars. Okay. I just downloaded it. 
<laughs> Did you download the app? No, I'm kind of skeptical now. Oh, that you have every right to be. Anyways, we're gonna end our night watching The Gentleman. This is like our new binge show. Some nights we'll get to two episodes. It's pretty good. And of course, what's his face is in it? Gustavo, the drug lord, and um. Oh yeah. It's Gustavo, right? Well, I mean, most people know him as the black guy that owns a chicken restaurant. In Breaking Bad, there you go. But yeah, the show, is, it's pretty interesting. I just really dislike the gruesome parts because that's, I mean, I guess it comes with the territory. This director loves seeing blood on people's faces, which is just so disturbing to me, but. Yeah, that's it. Just hanging out with Ollie here. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Night-night. Good night. Good night. Good night, Ollie.